Hello, welcome to the video. So this is Idle Fitness Gym Tycoon. And let's start here. We have our biking parking. Then we have the entrance where you can upgrade uh, how fast people are let in. Right now we have more entrances than there are people. So that's fine. This guy is the ad watcher. We have 24Q. He wants to give us three. No thanks. So these are the machines. Running, bench press, spinning, boxing, rowing. And the ones we don't have is XFIT, abs, weightlifting, martial arts, leg workout, and spa. So this is how the passive, you know, output or the input people. So we get 25 people per minute. But now we put an ad in, so that's 20% higher. Maybe I should have used a better one. Well, my least profitable is the spinning. Most profitable is the boxing. So this is my running machine. This is my bench press and this is my spinning. This is the worst one, they say. So let's see if we can upgrade it. What do we get off the concert sound system we get? With what? There was nothing after. Wow. That's the first time I didn't get an upgrade. So here we are boxing. We are punching a missile. Hopefully there will be no explosive results. And this is the rowing. The faster you row, the quicker you make this large fan turn. Perfect staying cool or catching a cold. <laughs> it even has the green smoke around it. So people line up for the machines and stuff like that. Whatever they want. So this here improves how fast they train. How long they stay on the machine. This is how many machines we have. More machines mean more people. Faster training means better flow through. Sometimes you have these angry people. Not sure why. Either it's because they have been standing in queue for so long or I didn't have the thing they wanted to do. I'm not sure. Here you can have instant exercise. Here is 11 extra customers. Oof, that wasn't many at all. So this thing is a group class. So we have to fill it up. Oh, they got angry. So this thing doesn't start until it's full, but it should be full now, so it should be starting. There we go. Then they all pay at the same time, and then they go for 18 seconds, and time between classes is 9 seconds. So it may start before it's full, actually. They will wait for 9 seconds. So here is my elite athlete. I have Laura here. I can train her in something. And you can send her on events sometimes. I uh, lost last time. This is the locker room. How many people that can uh, put their locker things in here? Oh, we were actually out of lockers, so that's good. I think these are actually real time, how they open and close. So that's cool. Watch an ad, we get a bike. 20% more people on bikes. They don't use lockers. So you can have as many of those as you want. Well, as many parking spots you have. This game has a prestige system. So after a while, you will simply build a new gym where you can put like one or two more things into. Like when I first started, I didn't have the rowing or boxing. Then I got a new gym and then I could build them. Oh, let's claim some stuff. I'm claiming a lot of stuff. I got like, I don't know, 80 points. Rowing is the most profitable. Running is the least. So this is the renovation. Basic gym. Urban gym. I need 250Q to get the fitness gallery. And then there's hidden. It's a pretty good game to see them uh, come and work out. But yeah, there is no gameplay in it, you know, apart from watching them. Let's get the running instructor. Let's see if that's actual uh, thing on the map. Well, that's kind of hard to see. Let's do the same here. Oh, too costly. Too costly. Oh, can't afford any of them. Too bad. 
Now we can train her again, some speed. Loa, professional tomb raider. She can jump long distances and climb just about any mountain. Okay, <laughs> I didn't notice that that, that was uh, that kind of Laura. Now it wants to give us one Q. It gave us three before. I think I'm going to call it here. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.